Frank Barnett Parsons. I'd like to entertain you with the idea. I see we've got a lot of banners in town that's on the poles are getting pretty well weathered. I'd like to entertain with the idea of LCHS and Album would like to get some banners approved and sold and promotion and put up in Parsons. Who would? LC and Album School. <laughs> That's a fine idea. <laughs> yes, Mr. Shaw. There's a lot of people pay taxes in this city. Yeah, and this a is idea. a true school district city. Yep. Yep. Are you denying it? No, I, maybe you volunteer to hang it. <laughs> <laughs> well, they can be hung just like the rest of them get hung. Why not? All right. Um, who, who's bringing this up? I haven't heard anything from the school, I don't believe. Debbie? Yeah. I've been in contact with them. I think they'd like a promotion and sell banners and get sponsorship just like anybody else. Are you the spokesman for them? Or? I will be. Okay. Because I graduated from there. I live here and I pay taxes here. And I, I don't see why. I, I think if you don't allow it, this is a two school district divided in this city. Well, I'm not going to. It's hard to. And, if, and if, what's the criteria? Yes or no? We have never been. Well, let me back up. 503 has some banners on 18th Street. They're yes. permanent banners. They're not ones we take up and down. Right. They were purchased by 503. Mm -hmm. I have never been contacted by anyone from 506 to put any banners or anything of any permanent nature anywhere. Okay. So they would just need to contact us and if we can, I mean, if they have a fundraiser or something, we can work with them. All right. But as I see, there's been no contact. Okay. If you were, would you entertain the idea? Sure. We would look at it. I mean, huh? We would look at it. We'd have to see where they're wanting to put them and what they have in mind. Because these banners have mainly been purchased by downtown Parsons. The state hospital would have purchased the ones for the Sunbelt Rodeo. We wouldn't be asking you to purchase them. They would, they okay, would be purchased have, through their school district in a promotional. Okay, but sir, we have the maintenance of putting them up, taking them down, because we have a cycle that these others run, in, but we have no problem of possibly working theirs into the cycle, but there'd have to be a lot more communication right now. Than well, this, that's, that's what I'm wondering. What would it take? And uh, they need the, the idea of taking them up and putting them down, you take it and put everybody else's up and down, so there would be no take. If Dr. Wyrick would like to contact us, we'll, if Dr. Wyrick, the superintendent, would like to contact us, we can okay. talk we'll, to him. We'll, we'll take it under advisement. Thank well, you. And see what we work out. One Thank thing you. I would add to that, I think, is uh, <coughs> probably, you know, I, I'm a LCHS fan. I'm two of my kids graduated from there. But um, Parsons is a two district town, but the LCHS portion of that district is over 32nd Street. So that might be an appropriate place for LCHS banners rather than in in the downtown in the city of Parsons. But that's just just a thought. Make any difference? It really would make any difference. If that's what you want to do, is separate them. Fine. Well, we're, we'll we'll take uh, Debbie's uh, recommendation and Dr. Wyrick can uh, contact her with any. Uh, presentation and we'll go from there. I'm just curious if it was the people was possible.